Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 15 box sweet shot basketball mixer. Big thanks to these folks right here for getting into the action. These folks bought their spots straight up thanks to them. And these folks were lucky enough to win spots in those cello pack breaks. So thanks to you guys too and girls. Big thanks to the teams for existing. And let's roll it. Let's randomize it four and a three seven times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we've got Bradley all the way down to Bradley. And four and a three, seven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, and final time. After seven, it's Oklahoma City Thunder down to the Atlanta Hawks. All right, so Bradley, Oklahoma City Thunder, Taylor with the T-Wolves, Joe with the Suns, Frank with the Celtics, Brett with the Grizz, Michael with the Heat, Cody with the Nuggets, Diane, you got the Kings, Bradley with the Jazz, Robert with the Knicks, Taylor with the Wizards, Ross with the Sixers, John with the Mavs, John DeGarmo with the Clip Show, John D with the Raptors, Maverick with the Bucks, Ross with the Rockets, Sean with the Lakers, you got my Lakers, Aaron with the Magic, Brandon, Last Bod Mojo, Pacers, Jack, you got the Nets, Jeff with the Bulls, Asa with the Blazers, Joe with the Cavs, Andrew with the Pelicans, Wes with the Pistons, Marco with the Spurs, Patrick with the Warriors, Adam Kelly with the Hornets, and Bradley with the Atlanta Hawks. So let's sort that by team. Let's box them up really quick. Any trades, ladies and gentlemen? While you're thinking about trades, here are the boxes right here. And we're giving away this at the end. It's a nice Pascal Siakam. Looks like, is that the, that maybe looks like the P of Raptors. So pretty nice. We'll set this over here. Make sure someone remind me not to, not to forget that. We've got some, these are some of the old boxes that we have in here. We got draft picks, we got crown, we've got innovation, limited, totally certified, a, a hanger, hang tag box right here. We've got some seven, 2007, 2008 Fleer. Some Ascension back there. Look at this. Look at that. Look at this blast from the past. So that's pretty nice stuff. Well, I'm, I may hold this to closer to the end. I mean, there may be nothing in there. <laughs> it may just be scrubs in there, but it could be something amazing in there as well. All right, I'm going to pause the video, allow for a little bit of uh, trade chatter when we come back. We'll see if there's any trades, and then we'll break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, folks. Some trade offers out there, but no deals were done in the 15-box Sweet Shot Basketball Mixer here on Friday the 10th. Thanks for spending a bit of your Friday with us. We really appreciate that. I really appreciate that. You can be doing a lot of other things, a lot of, a lot of shows to binge, a lot, of, a lot of things to catch up on. All right, I don't know where to let's, – let's start with, let's start with this. Um, we've got this box right here with LeBron rookies in here. I'm going to save this closer towards the end. Maybe not the very end, but close to the end. What's this? What's in 0708?
Eight pancakes. How many pancakes is one too many for you guys? What's that number? The, 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 the most popular answer among those surveyed on Family Feud, which we're watching right now, was three. I feel like, for little old Joe here, I think three is about right. I could probably get to, I could probably get to a four, depending on the, on the, on the, the di diameter? of the uh, of the pancake but I feel like four I feel like would three or four would be one too many curry says five our friend Brandon here on TV said eight. Oh, he ruined it for this family by the way he got two zeros a ten a thirteen and a three like his mom or whoever that was she she posted 140 on the board Come on, Walker family is pissed. Is this Kevin Durant? Let's let's. William says yes. Mm hmm. Oh, good. William remembers that no Greg Oden autos because he was a Topps exclusive. Durant was the second overall. Then Horford, Al Horford at three. Mike Conley is in there. Joachim Noah. I think that's about it. Marc Gasol was in this class too. And Jeff Green. And then what happened to Yi Jian Liang? China. He went to uh, the Milwaukee Bucks. Corey Brewer. Brandon Wright. Thaddeus Young. Rodney Stuckey was in this class. Nick Young. Picked up by the Wizards. So yeah, Tiago Splitter's in there too. Yeah, I'll send that Jordan. I was going to send it. I was going to be like, hey, look at that Jordan. Absolutely. Not too many Jordan cards out there in the world. At least not in the 2000s. All right, so let's roll through. I don't know what we're guaranteed or not guaranteed in this box. I didn't look. Veteran commons don't ship, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, well, I mean, but you know, you know. I'm not familiar with these sets, so I have to like look carefully, make sure I don't. This notable newcomer, Joakim Noah. This is a few years after Le LeBron, the LeBron James rookie box is up there. Oh, and we got a uh, Nene relic. Look how young he looks there. Hot materials. Cody with the Denver Nuggets. Another MJ. There's Kevin Durant. Look how young he looks. Notable newcomers. Very skinny. Kind of hard to split some of these cards apart. I think over the years, the sort of the ink on here melts a little. I don't know what the, the terminology would, for that would be, but...
Did he really? William said he had a great pre-draft video of him shooting versus a chair. He went sixth overall. A young Jerry Sloan looks as a player right there. Well, I mean, it's that aside from like Durant and Joe Kim Noah, and even Al Horford, this wasn't a very impressive rookie class. So it's not like the Bucks passed up on anybody, you know? Like they could have taken Corey Brewer instead, Brandon, maybe Yo Kim Noah, but your choices were Spencer, well, who, who, he was a power forward. So Brandon Wright. Thaddeus Young, Spencer Haas, maybe, Julian Wright, Al Thornton, Sean Williams. I mean, they they could have they could have taken those guys. <laughs> Alright. That was one of our older boxes there. We're gonna hold on to 0304. We did we just did 0708, that was on my list. And then we're gonna jump ahead to what about 1213? Alright. There's 1213. We're going to jump ahead a handful of years. So in 12, that's the that's the Anthony Davis here. Anthony Davis, Michael Kidd Gilchrist, Bradley Beal were your top 3, then Deion Waiters, Thomas Robinson, Dame Dame is in this. Damian Lillard, Andre Drummond in here. William, you have a lot of memories of this of of that 07 class. He was supposed to be a deep draft, he remembers. All right. So this, this one's a pretty good class. In the top 10 picks, you have one, two, three, four all-stars. Three multiple-time all-stars. Anthony Davis, Damian Lillard, Andre Drummond are multiple-time All-Stars. Bradley Beal, a one-time All-Star. So four All-Stars in the top ten. It's pretty good. You know, you got a franchise player in Damian Lillard and Anthony Davis. Two out of the top ten. That's pretty good. All right, so let's keep an eye out for those guys. So Anthony Davis would definitely be New Orleans edition. New Orleans stuff will go to New Orleans. Charlotte stuff will go to Charlotte. There's Anthony Davis right here. Ah, uh, because because Port that's right, Portland taking Odin, so 07 sticks out to you. Man, I'm trying to think back to that Greg Oden draft. Was it really that? I mean, did they just walk into? Let's go 13, 14 innovation. But no, we got limited. 12, 13 limited. Like I remember Greg Oden having injury, just degenerative knee issues or something. Like that. He's a big guy. For the Lakers. Did he play a single game? Why did they do that? There's Corey Maggette. Marcin Gortat. And Jimmy Butler autograph. Jimmy Butler. There's his autograph. There's Jimmy Butler. And that's Tristan Thompson. So that's a 349. Jimmy Butler looks incredibly young there too. I'll top load these just because they're weird die cuts. 
Bulls. That'll be for Jeff Thorfinson. There you go, Jeff. It's pretty nice, actually. Is that, is that rookie Jimmy Butler? No, I don't think so, but nice Jimmy Butler. <laughs> Tristan Thompson is here as well. To 299. And that's for the Cavs. That'll be for Joseph Pearson. It's Ty Lawson to 199. Lights out relic. Denver Nuggets. That'll be for um, that'll be for Cody, and Dirk Nowitzki base card and Serge Ibaka as well. When healthy is awesome. It would have been like Embiid. See, I don't consider Odin a bust because because he never got a chance. Like the injuries pretty much derailed his his career from from the start. All right, let's see. Let's go to. Should we stay in 2012? I think we got a. We did the hoops last year. We did the limited. So I think we're going to go a year ahead into 2013 14, which we have one box of. That's innovation, which is right there. So let's skip ahead here. So 13 14, that's Anthony Bennett when one. Oladipo went two. Otto Porter, Cody Zeller, Alex Len, Nerlens Noel, Ben McLemore, KCP, Trey Burke, CJ McCollum, Michael Carter Williams, Stephen Adams, Kelly Olnick, Shabazz Muhammad, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Odin's bow. No, but Bowie actually played though, right? And was actually decent. But I always felt bad. Yeah, I felt bad for Odin too. But like, but Anthony Bennett's actually a bust, right? I feel like he actually worked at it, but just didn't go anywhere. There's Brooke Lopez, Kyrie. To 199, Michael Cooper autograph. Nice. Foundations Inc., Old Laker. Going to Sean Kirkham. And another Laker, Jody Meeks, die cut to 235, an autograph. Nice. Yeah, <laughs> Brett's like Bennett was fat and slow. I mean, that's a bust right there. It was honorable memorabilia, memorable memorabilia, LeBron James, Miami Heat edition, Michael Lyons. Reggie Bullock. <laughs> Ryan's like, Bowie only averaged... Did he really? I guess for a big guy in that area, he should have had more, huh? All right. So, Sam Bowie, not so great. Uh, let's see. Let's go to a great box then. How about 13? We're at 13, 14. So now let's jump ahead to 14, 15. Just looking at my list here. Yeah. So that's Donner's Basketball. 14, 15, that's the Andrew Wiggins, Jabari Parker, Joel Embiid were the top three. Then Aaron Gordon, Exum, Saric is in this, Zach Levine's in this, Clint Capella, so on and so forth. Nikola Jokic. That's this one over here. <laughs> that's right, Mike Tower. You can't teach fat and slow. Anthony Bennett worked at it. No, I mean, and, and if you, I just looked at his Wikipedia. He floated around like a bunch of G League teams, went international. Like, he tried to grind it out, but... That's, I mean, isn't, how scary is that? Your franchises are dependent upon, like, a teenage kid. You don't know, like, you know, they say all the right things coming out of college, but you don't know what their work ethic really is going to be like until they're meeting up with pros, you know, veteran NBA players. But I wonder, like, it's not like, I, rem I want to say that people thought he was going to be a top five pick, so it's not like, it's not like the, 
it's not like the Cavs just went rogue, or did they? I don't remember clearly, but it's not. I don't think the Cavs just went rogue and took a player that no one was saying was going to be a top five player at least. So it's crazy. Stephen Punk, with an, I, I love Stephen Punk's hot, crazy takes. Weird feeling next year. Chicago Bulls get Anthony Davis and a good draft pick trade. Wendell, oh, and good, a good draft pick trade. Wendell Carter to Golden State. And then they make the playoffs next year. A lot of wild things in, there, in that scenario, Stephen Punk. I'm not sure if I'm with you on that. Stephen Punk, you, you're reminding me of one of my friends who just spits out like a dozen hot, crazy takes, nails one of those, and then it's just like, yeah, see, told you that crazy, that one crazy thing was going to happen. And then I'm like, what about the other nine crazy things that didn't happen? And he's like, what? What are you talking about? I don't remember that. That, what do you, what? I didn't say anything like that. But he nails that one thing, and then he's crowing about it all, all week. He's like, yeah, told you guys that was going to happen. You guys should have listened to me. I'm like, all right, dude. <laughs> no, it's not Nick. <laughs> but I guess he kind of does that too sometimes. He just Nick just says that he can, he can fight Mike Tyson and, and win. Uh, Mavs. He says more things crazy like that. It's like, oh, I can throw a football a mile or that. You know, it's mostly the Mike Tyson thing. 84 out of 149. Uh, the Tim Hardaway autograph goes to the Warriors. Patrick K. No, I will, I will not name and shame this friend. Someday you might meet him and then he'll be like, hey, that's the guy Joe was talking about. He says you're insane. It's like, what? I didn't say that. There's the Marcus Aldridge, Dominators. It's one to 99, Derek Rose. Marcus Cousins. I understand that Anthony Davis is from Chicago. There's Boogie going to the Kings, Diane Relic. But how often does does that happen? People people are talking about, oh, Katie's going to go back home to D.C. I feel like that's. I feel like everyone brings that up as a scenario, but but I feel like that never that never ends up being a big factor. We'll sleeve and top load all those numbered cards that I'm sliding through. Make sure they get sleeved and top loaded before they go out. I'm trying to think, when's the last time some major free agent was like, I don't think it happened. I mean, I'm sure it has happened, but I'm, I don't think it happens too often. Right, LeBron going back to Cleveland, right. But when's the last time someone... Because a lot of times players, a lot of pros say, I don't want to play back home because then I'm, I'm like honoring ticket requests all the time. Like, 
you know, like my family and friends are there. Like it, it's a distraction to my profession, you know, when I'm trying to grind and my, my boys want to go out and party and blah, blah, like people come out of the woodwork looking for ticket requests and all that sort of stuff. So I feel like, I feel like a lot of pros tend to say that they don't want to go back home. But I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here trying to think. All right. Oh, there you go, William. That's a good one. Kawhi. Yeah, very good point. I guess PG, too, if you think about it. You know, both of those guys were like, yeah, I would love to come back to L.A. and play. Well, who else? All right, that was fourteen fifteen. Uh, now let's go into. Do we have any sixteen seventeen here? Scanning the list, no. But we have a couple seventeen eighteens. We got that totally certified. Way to the Bulls, yeah. I guess I guess in my head the criteria is like Stephen Punk's talking about Anthony Davis, like someone in the prime of his career as as a free agent going to uh, yes, this is the Tatum year, Frank. So you'll need to pay attention to the next couple boxes. Is Carmelo free? Agent when he went to the Knicks? I think he was he? Alright, so he went back home. But I think, I mean, in the end of the day, Brett's right. It's just whatever team's a better place to win, and, and actually, whatever place pays the most money, too. No, see them? Yeah, Melo got traded, right? I thought too. <laughs> I know, Stephen Punk. <laughs> All right, there's Delo to ninety nine. Is Mellow? I don't. I thought Mellow was a New Yorker. There's Fabric of the Game, Cinderius Thornwell to 249, Clippers, Relic for John, Lori Markinen, CJ McCollum, no Jason Tatum rookie cards, there's a Dwayne Bacon, mmm, Bacon. Oh man, Dwayne Bacon, I was looking forward to him playing with the Hornets down the stretch. In a G League game, maybe a few weeks before the NBA shut everything down, in a G League game, I think he dropped 40 or 50. He was ready. He was ready to sizzle. But no. There's 17-18 right here. U.S. Matthews to the Bucks, yeah. That's the high caliber free agent where everyone's like, yep, oh, he's going home. Going back to Milwaukee. Sparkly to the Rock, that was kind of later in his career, I think. Hi, D Nip. Dennis in the house. Giannis, I want to I want to see Giannis become a free agent, and Giannis say I'm going back home. 
I'm going to play for a Panthenikos. I'm going to play for 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 our Panathinaikos in Athens going back home. Just dominate that league. Dominate Greek basketball and just just set insurmountable records. If that team, if that team, if Panthenikos puts puts some shooters around him, I'm telling you, they are going undefeated in that Greek league. I tell you that, undefeated. And so after after Giannis sets single season records there, and says I have nothing left to prove in Greece, and then comes back to the United States. Nice Bam out of bio. Frank Tillakina was supposed to be a somebody. My doctor. Name the age people start feeling old. Boy. Name a word that rhymes with fiddle. Pass. Name Kibble. a type of berry. Dog. Straw. Name something you'd hate to discover in your pantry. A bug. Pass. Give me a word that rhymes with fiddle. <laughs> a bug. That's what I said. That was my answer. A bug. Tyler Dorsey. <laughs> Here's Donovan Mitchell rated rookie going to Bradley. There you go, Bradley. And Luke Kennard. 33 out of 99. Detroit Pistons Black Velocity. That'll be for Wes. Stephen Punk, we're gonna need a we're gonna, at some point. There's Zoo Key to one seventy five. At some point, we're gonna need to write down all of your all of your uh, crazy hot takes. And there's Avery Bradley, and then see which ones you hit on. All right. At seventeen eighteen, sorry, sorry, Frank. Oh, no, we got one more seventeen. Do we have a Donruss optic? No, we no, we just did that. Sorry, seventeen eighteen, no more, no mas. Seventeen eighteen. I think we're now in eighteen nineteen. Oh no, we have seventeen eighteen ascension. Frank, one more shot for your Celtics. We got we got seventeen eighteen ascension. But wait, there's more. Wasn't West Matthews? Was that is is that the same West Matthews willing that was on the Lakers for a little bit? I kind of wish we kept that guy. Another chance for Frank and everybody else, whoever else is in here. All right, there's Wes Wundu, Isaiah Thomas. D'Angelo Russell to 125. Reggie Jackson autograph to 199 Pistons. That's for Wes Thomas.
Frank Tilakina. This is 1718, so the year after that Ben Simmons rookie year. No, oh, Sundarius Thornwell. No, none there. Matt McCray, what's up? Um, no, we were doing the mixer, which is going to take us a little while longer, and then uh, then we're, we got tribute three, and that's going to bring us right to the end of the night. So we are booked for the night, I'm afraid. Um... 1819 stuff. Yeah, I think we're in 1819 now. There's 1819 hoops, 1819 threads. What's this year right here? What court kings is this? 1819 court kings. And then we'll do a few 1920 boxes and then we'll close with this box right here. All right, so let's work through this hoops. So this, of course, 1819. Is this our only 1819 box? I think so. Oh no, no, I mean these these three. Yeah. So 1819, of course, Trey Young, Luka Doncic, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Yeah, Frank, it's not over yet. If you're going hitless in this break and you're and you're starting to despair. And you're like, oh man, what a crappy break. Why did I get into this mixer? You know, blah, 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 blah. You still have a chance to win this, which according to a recent sale, according to Nick Jaspi, he's saying that recent sale, $439, so 400 bucks right there, basically. So, still have a shot at that, ladies and gentlemen. One spot in 30 is going to win that Pascal Siakam, ladies and gentlemen. As long as you're in, you have a chance to win. Uh, I have no idea what 430, what's 430 American dollars in Canada, in Canadian loonies, is that what they call it? Probably 600 Canadians, says Frank. Uh, was Wes Matthews never on the Lakers? Who am I thinking of then? Wes John? Wes... There's a Wes somebody. Okay. That's right, Michael G. You gotta play to the whistle. You never know. You never know what's gonna happen. Anthony Simons. Just looking for Trey Young's basically and Luka Doncic's, right? There's Jaron Jackson Jr. Uh oh, and how many cents, Frank? Is it just downhill from there? Ooh, nice Michael Porter Jr. autograph. That's pretty strong. Denver. That's for Cody. Casino. 
As soon as I turn these around, it'll, it'll go the right, go the other way. Oh, there's DeAndre Ayton. That's right, DeAndre Ayton's in that class too. Oh, there he is. Luka Doncic, rookie card. Dallas Mavericks, John, who won that spot in a cello pack break. Got randomized. Dallas. There you go. How many boxes do I have left, Matt's asking? That many. Eric Dampier, Dallas Mavericks again for John. Maybe a Trey Young. We got DeAndre Ayton, Luka Doncic. Trey Young would be nice. There's SGA. People like the SGA. Gary Trent. I thought that was going to be Trey for a second. There he is. I was upside down. I almost missed that. There you go. Hey, DeAndre Ayton, Trey Young, Luka Doncic. It's pretty nice. Atlanta Hawks, Bradley. <clears throat> All right. Threads first and then corkings. Premium threads. All right, good luck, ladies and gents. Harrison Barnes to 75. LeBron James to 199. DeMar DeRozan to 199. Brian Forbes to 75. I'll set that. Kyle Lowry to 199. Andrew Wiggins to 199. Bruce Bowen is your autograph. 42 out of 100. Spurs. Marco Mills with the Spurs. Josh Okoye, 30 out of 105. Goes to the Timberwolves. Taylor with the T-Wolves. Miles Bridges. To uh, 199, we've got Jerome Robinson to 199. Carl Anthony Towns, Steph Curry, Anthony Davis, Paul George, and Kevin Durant to 199. 1819, Court Kings. What's up, Michael G? Got you have a 2017 Super Short Print. Yeah, Mike Jackson from Ginter. Oh, shoot us an email on that. Jaspiescasebreaks at gmail.com, Michael. Maybe we can, we'll figure something out. Ryan Hack saying, having to stop by Target while the guy was restocking sports cards, trading cards. And he said that they're putting the out old stuff because cards are selling so well right now. Haven't seen any basketball in over a month. Yeah, when, when all this COVID closure and stuff, all that craziness started, I was a little concerned about the secondary market 
and just sales in general as, as one is want to be. But we had a couple people that we were buying some cards from for, for future products, for repack, Jaspi repack products. And we asked him, Nick and I asked him, we were like, hey, how's business? Like, things going with, you know, how's, how are things on secondary marketing? He was like, I can't put stuff up on eBay fast enough. So, I, and, and especially for the elite players, I think in general, things seem to be moving pretty nicely. There's Miles Bridges and Jalen Brunson. Fresh paint autograph. Eighty-six out of ninety-nine. Jason Jaspi was telling me that Jalen Brunson stuff has been slowly increasing on the secondary market. John, that one, and there's a sovereign autograph. That's old Spur James Silas. To ninety-nine, another one for Marco and the Spurs. That's to ninety-nine. Trey Young, level one. And Anthony Trier, level three. Some value in that Miles Bridges there too, Adam Kelly. That portraits. Okay. We're going to save this till the very end, I think. Look for LeBron rookie cards. Doesn't want to stand up there. All right, let's get the uh, draft picks. Going. No, 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 didn't take that like that at all. It'll be a fun little thing to put put together. Wait, are, are Mike and Mike and Ryan running to each other at the post office and hanging out at Jaspie's? Small world. Tachimura, Bruno Fernando to 249, Grant Williams. And here's a nice Matisse Teibel, rookie auto for the Sixers. Ross Rogerson, Philadelphia, nice. Not numbered, but... Good card there. There's Hachimura. Kyle Guy to 299. Grant Williams to 149. And Vic Law. The long arm of the law, Vic Law. I don't know where he goes. We'll look that up. John Morant, I've heard of him. John Morant, I've heard of him. Casey with Paul, I've heard of him too. So both of these will go to the Grizz. Brett Foy with the Grizzlies. Tremont Waters. And there's Devontae Kaka. Kakak. Kasok. Don't know. We'll look it up. We'll get it to the right place. Mioni, Matisse Teibel again, R.J. Barrett, Jackson Hayes for the Pelicans, Darius Garland for the Cavs, and Jalen Hands. Don't remember where he goes, but we'll get it to the right place. R.J. Barrett. Crusade Silver. Let's put on that side. That's my recap side. Zion. John Morant again. Carson Edwards. Okay, there was a card stuck behind there. That was Matisse Teibel to 250. And Davidas Servitas. All right, nice John Morant. And his college gear, Brett Foy and the Grizz. And that Zion is a nice one for Andrew and the Pelicans. Nice crusade. I wish it was like a rookie silver. That would be that would be massive, but 
Uh, well, let's see what's let's see what's happening in here. LeBron James and Luka Samanich Relic. That is for the Spurs. Marco with the Spurs. I like all of these cracked ice kind of look right there. We'll sleeve and top load all of those before they go out. No, nothing massive there. All right, what about here? Good luck. This is the current class, 1920. All right. Good luck, folks. We're almost there. Coming up after this will be the uh, will be tribute baseball, and that should that'll bring us right to the end of the night. So thanks, everyone. Looking for LeBrons in there. Cavs LeBron rookie LeBrons in there. What? What's the question? Things that a pimp would hold prophylactic rubbers yeah cards is the caveman in the same in that same rookie class that's what William's saying William Ellis saying rookie Chris Caymans so wake up clip clip clippers I don't know who the caveman was drafted by. All right, let's still keep our minds on 1920 for now. Let's see if we could finish strong with some silver somethings. No. Some Tyler Heroes. Kobe White. No, there's Malik Beasley. Derek White. That will ship, but it's not number. The Red Wave. Emergent Jackson Hayes. Derek White. Cam Reddish, green. Atlanta Hawks, Bradley. Tremont Waters, rookie silver. Jared Harper is the autograph. Rookie penmanship for the Suns. That'll be for Joe. LeBron James, Lakers, Sean. Still have a decent stack here to try to find Silver Jaw, Silver Zion. There's another one right here. No, that's Terrence Ross. Ben Simmons, Silver. Do we like Ben Simmons? Fourth year Ben Simmons stuff? silver all right that's it nothing exciting nothing terribly exciting there but there could be something very exciting 
in this old upper deck box here. 2003-2004 upper deck sweet shot basketball. I only have like vague memories of this. And Michael Jordan swatch would be cool. Hmm. All right. Good luck, everybody. Let's see what's inside. All right, so obviously in 2003 NBA draft, your number one overall pick was LeBron James by the Cleveland Cavaliers. Uh, Darko Milic was the second pick. Then it was Carmelo, Chris Bosh, Dwayne Wade. What a class. Chris Kamen was six overall. Kind of drops off from there. Collison's in the mix. David West is there. Josh Howard. Mo Williams, Kyle Korver, second rounders. Yeah, that's right. Luke Walton and Steve Blake in this class. Uh, the Celtics took, they have uh, Dante Jones, if you remember Dante Jones. I think that's who the Celtics had. I don't know if all those players are even in this set, but I was just reading off the the... the the people who were drafted that year. We got an autograph right over here. Signature shots, Carmelo Anthony. Look how young he looks. Woo. Your third overall pick. Wow, this was just sitting there by the Nuggets. Just marinating since 2003. That is awesome. Rookie Carmelo Anthony. Denver Nuggets, Cody. Cody G. Nice. It's an awfully thick card for this. <laughs> Not right there. All right. Shaq. Oh, so that's how they're going to do us, huh? Those big thick cards there is Eddie Jones. Yeah. 
And we've got a blazer right here. There's Amari Stoudemire. Nope, Damon Stoudemire. Sweet swatches for the Trailblazers. Ben Wallace. Kind of like a die cut in the. Where are you, LeBron? And we've got a little dual relic in here. Ray Allen. Game jerseys. Sonic stuff, of course, goes to the Thunder. That'll go to Bradley. Sorry, I should have mentioned that before the box. But that's how we've been doing it. Yeah, I'll see what I can do, Frank. It might knock it up to priority mail. I don't know if you want to send send that. They're like a pound each. Come on, LeBron. Kind of hard to see the names right there. Great start with a Carmelo Anthony, but I was hoping we get at least one LeBron James card. But I guess not. But this was nice. Rookie Carmelo Anthony, right, right on a piece of a uh, piece of the basketball. Nice break, nice mixer, everybody. Let's randomize that card to someone. All right. Pascal Siakam. Everyone has a chance at the Pascal Siakam. So let's uh, go to some new dice. Well, let's go back to the list first. Grab everybody's names from Bradley down to Taylor. Let's pop it into this list right here. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Seven times. Lucky seven. Name on top gets the Pascal Siakam uh, RPA from National Treasures Basketball. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, six and a one. Good luck, everyone. Thanks for getting into this mixer. Really appreciate it. And the winner is going to be Patrick K, who won that spot in a cello pack break. I don't think I called your name all break. So that Pascal Siakam RPA going to you. 15 out of 49. Excellent patch there too. Thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you next time on... Oh, let me do a recap. Let's, but I'll see you next time on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Recap! So a bunch of different cards here. Obviously, all of these will be top loaded. That Carmelo was nice. Jersey, some Zion, some Jaws, some fresh paint, LeBron James, some rookie cards here, rookie Trey, rookie Luca, rookie DeAndre Ayton, Michael Porter Jr. autograph. It's a nice break for Denver. There's LeBron James Relic. A couple Lakers autographs here. There was Michael Cooper. Tristan Thompson, Jimmy Butler. Nice die cut autographs. Anthony Davis, rookie year. Kobe Bryant, Kobe. Michael, this is from the Hot Prospects, Fleer Hot Prospects that we popped open, which is pretty cool. There's KD as well. Jordan, Kobe, another Jordan right here as well. There you have it, boys and girls. That was the, uh, what do we call this? The 10 box. 
15 box sweet shot basketball mixer from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.